Good morning everybody. Welcome to Richmond's Place Homestead and I'm Matt. Today we're here to talk about home safety and installing a carbon monoxide detector. Um, recently there was a news report of a family of seven who passed away from carbon monoxide. Their furnace had malfunctioned and it killed the entire family of seven. Um, which made me realize we do not have a carbon monoxide detector in our house. So I looked at them online. Um, they're pretty inexpensive for the safety. Um, range anywhere from 15 to $30. And uh, so we purchased one. We plan on purchasing several more. Um, Today we're going to install, I'm going to teach you how to install the carbon monoxide detector. The things that we'll need to install the carbon monoxide detector are laid out here. We need the carbon monoxide detector. We're going to need a drill to drill the pilot holes. We're going to need a measuring tape to measure the height. And we're going to need a stud finder to find a stud, a level, a pencil, and I've also grabbed a couple of my own screws because I'm never happy with the screws that are provided with the product. The carbon monoxide detector should be installed at a height of about five feet. Now that we know where about five feet is, we're going to use a stud finder to find the stud. We've marked it with a pencil. That way we can go back and erase it if we want. Now we're going to check our height to make sure that we're five feet. And we'll put a little crosshair mark for our five foot. We're going to draw a line. We're going to make sure that we're level here. Alright, now that we've established our line, now we're going to put our first pilot hole in. Now this model came with this bracket for us to install it on. And there's a right way and a wrong way to install this. So we got to make sure that uh, we've installed it correctly. This being the back of the plate, we will install it against the wall. We will install the, or we will drill a pilot hole for the second screw. We're going to put the second screw in. Good. 
we've installed the battery in it and now we're going to hang it on the wall. We have now successfully installed our carbon monoxide detector. Let's push the test button to make sure it works. 